Hello and welcome to Tastes Like Victory. We need to update that graphic one of these days. It's looking kind of old right now. This is the show that started off as a taste testing show, but then the, I realized those are about a dime a dozen. Decided to add a little twist to these things. Today we're going to try something someone in Pepsi thought was a good idea. While I'm pretty sure that the rest of the world was like, nah, nah fam, I'm good. I'm good. Nah, don't do it. No, don't do it. No, don't, don't, don't do it. Today we got Pepsi Fire. Here's the funny thing about me and cinnamon. Cinnamon is probably a bad idea when it comes to me. Like, oh, I mean, I'm talking about like cinnamon candies. I'm not talking about like cinnamon, cinnamon, cinnamon. Mainly because if anything that involves cinnamon or cinnamon heat, like red hot gum or hot tamales or blah, 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 kind of swells up my tongue a little bit. Not allergic reaction. I'm talking about I have cracks in my tongue, which is so, a little bit of TMI. But back in the day, back in the lovely, lovely days of yesteryear when I was a kid, I used to eat warheads all the time. And if you go a little bit too much with warheads, and this was when they were like really, really sour. I think they toned them down quite a bit. But when they were really, really, really sour, and if you ate enough of them, they would damage you. That's what these did. They kind of damaged me and cracked my tongue up all over the place. <laughs> so uh, when you combine that, something that's cinnamon flavored or cinnamon candy kind of swells up a little bit because it gets into those cracks and those nooks and those crannies and it's not a good time but i feel like this was kind of a special occasion because this had been out this has been out for probably about a month now and it's cinnamon and it's horrible and it's probably horrible i haven't tasted it yet i've got one of these i've got actually two bottles of regular pepsi you'll see the second one later but um i wonder if you can see the color here the uh, fire one is definitely a lot lighter than the regular. I'm gonna put them in some glasses. We can get some better comparison too. It smells lightly like cinnamon. It smells more like of the clove kind of cinnamon, not like a red hot kind of cinnamon. Yeah, you, you're definitely not gonna mix these guys up like in terms of color. Like people are gonna know that it's cinnamon, uh, or it's kind of off because it's kind of closer to kind of like a cheer wine color. It's kind of pretty actually. Before I do this, I need to remember what regular Pepsi tastes like. So I was like, I'm gonna take a sip of the regular one just so I could get a taste, a good comparison between the two. See what happens when you add cinnamon to it. So let's get let's take a sip of the regular one. Oh yeah, just regular cola. That's sweet. It tastes sweeter than Coke. You're not here for that review. You're not here for that. You're here for what makes fire fire which I'm regretting already actually it smells really weird come to think of it when you get take what deeper whiffs so without further ado it's kind of weak yeah that's definitely weak I don't taste the cinnamon at all well okay Never mind. Here it comes. Yeah, they actually made a, a much lighter taste than what I was expecting. Oh my god. Okay. I feel it in the back of my throat. It's not hot. It's not like super cinnamon, ultra mega cinnamon, ultra hot cinnamon. Cinnamon. How many times can I say cinnamon in this episode? Let's find. Oh. Oh no. I feel it in my chest now. Oh, this is a bad idea. Okay, in your mouth, it's not hot. As it goes down, you start feeling it more and more. As far as taste is concerned, meh, kind of normal. If this was just a normal show, I would end it, things off here and say, oh, this stuff, meh, no, nothing too special, it's fine. But this isn't the show we're running today. Cause now I feel like this, I'm, I need a challenge. Now I need to challenge this drink. This drink is not as good as what it promised me. I was expecting fire in my mouth, but now I just got fire in my chest. So, I'll meet you over in the kitchen. We are in the kitchen right now, and if you can tell by the mic audio quality now, uh, we're basically using the camera's microphone because I don't have a shotgun mic for this. I need to afford one of those one of these days. Anyways, what I have lined up here, we have our Pepsi fire that we had beforehand. We have the regular Pepsi beforehand. And then, I promised you an extra bottle of this, and I don't know if you can see this because this is kind of gross right here, but this is uh, this is something I've done to this bottle of Pepsi. Now, let me tell you what I did to this Pepsi. I crushed up a couple of these uh, Brock cinnamon candies and I decided to toss it into said Pepsi so it started fizzing, which is a good sign, right? Uh, when you toss something in carbonation, it starts fizzing like extra more. 
And uh, good thing they didn't do the whole Mentos thing and explode all over the place. But this right here is probably going to be the spawn of Satan. Because um, it's got two of these. If I remember correctly, it gets kind of hot. And then on top of that, it's like once we get done with that, I got some ground cinnamon here so we can get more of an earthier kind of cinnamon taste. Probably mix it with a regular Pepsi or something. But we're going to try to rock and roll. So let's see what this tastes like because uh, I'm very curious. Uh, I'm not going to put it in a glass because I don't think anything special happened to the color. Oh my god. <laughs> You can smell it. I can tell that this ain't no pansy drink like the uh, Pepsi Fire. This is something that's a little bit stronger. Hmm. Oh, you actually taste the cinnamon this time. So this is, it's not that hot, but you actually taste it like, you taste cinnamon candy, which you would expect out of like the Pepsi Fire. But I can guarantee that this tastes better than the Pepsi Fire. It actually tastes pretty good. But, Anyways, it seems like there's something about Pepsi that nullifies like the intensity from the cinnamon on all these because Pepsi fire is not that hot until it goes down in your chest. And my own concoction of like the cinnamon candy Pepsi isn't that hot, but it actually tastes like it's cinnamon. So you can tell that. So that's the better one. What happens when I do something like this? What happens if I put uh, powdered cinnamon, ground cinnamon? Ooh. <laughs> This is real cinnamon, so I mean, it shouldn't really be hot anyway, but this should probably be really weird. So I'm going to throw this in the glass with a regular Pepsi, probably like about a teaspoon. For the sake of it not going everywhere, I have to put my hand underneath it, but this is about, this is as much. Come on, focus on me. Focus. You're not going to focus, are you? You're going to focus on my face. Let me get my face out of the way. This is about as much as I'm going to put in there. Oh, I gotta be careful of blowing it all over the place. And then probably, gonna, I might add a little bit more Pepsi to it, but I don't know yet. Eh. Whatever, let's stick it in there. Let's stir it up. Ew. <laughs> it's so gross. Oh my god. Ugh. This is a bad idea. Oh, it's foamy too. What have I done? Dudes, this stuff bubbles. <laughs> Alright, let's put some more Pepsi in there just so I can make the brown go away. Uh oh. <laughs> Alright, this looks nasty. It's kind of foaming on over the walls and all that. Uh, this is probably the worst idea I've ever had. But oh well. <laughs> so alright, so let's give this a shot. Let's do something really stupid. Eh, just tastes like cinnamon and Pepsi. Cinnamon and Pepsi. It's kind of more like a cinnamon shoot. Damn, that's interesting. This is more of like a cinnamon sugar kind of thing. Like if, if it, you've ever had cinnamon sugar toast before, it's like cinnamon sugar toast without the toast and it's liquid. So, unfortunately, I couldn't come up with anything hot. Unfortunately, it seems like Pepsi and cinnamon don't happen to add a lot of heat to things. But like my final verdict on the Pepsi fire, meh. I like the one that I came up with. If you may want to make a really good cinnamon Pepsi, get two of these cinnamon candies, crush them up, drop them in like a bottle of Pepsi, leave it overnight so it dissolves, and then you're good to go and you'll have the best version of cinnamon flavored Pepsi of all time. Don't do this, because this is gross. I really hope you enjoyed the video. I did, kind of. Leave me a comment on what you feel about executives making horrible business decisions. Leave me a like on my video, and if you're brand new here, hit that subscribe button. So as always, this is Ria Kuroku. Thumbs up, and I will catch you guys absolutely later. What year is this? <laughs>